Hi, you're watching Wink Sound, and in this video, you'll learn how to export audio from GarageBand. Exporting or bouncing your audio allows you to convert a multi-track session like this one into a stereo or mono audio file for easy sharing or distribution. Once your song is done and you're ready to export, the first thing you want to make sure you do is take this little end marker here, it's a little purple triangle, and this marks the end of the song. So you want to move this up against the last portion of your song. This way, when GarageBand exports, it won't export a lot of dead air at the end. It'll stop exactly where the song ends. So here's a short sequence. This is what it sounds like. Say we want to export this sequence. First, turn off loop. Hit enter, so my playhead goes to the beginning. This way it'll play through the entire sequence rather than just the loop portion. Now let's see what options GarageBand has for exporting this song. On the top menu, click on share, and the first share option is send song to iTunes. You click on this, GarageBand is gonna ask you for some basic information regarding iTunes. Once you've entered all the iTunes information, you could choose to export as a WAV or compress as an AAC or MP3 then you could customize the encoding options here. Another share option is send ringtone to iTunes. You could also send a podcast to iWeb. And here's the main export option, export song to disk. So as we saw before, here you could choose to export as a high quality WAV file, or you could compress the file as an MP3 or AAC file for easy sharing via email or any other type of file transfer service. For your audio settings, you could choose GarageBand's presets or you could customize your own encoding options for this song. Click Export. GarageBand will then ask you where do you want to save your song to. I will choose the GarageBand folder and hit Save. GarageBand will then export the audio file and place it in the destination you chose. So if I cycle through my app with Command Tab and go to my Finder, go to the GarageBand folder, Here's the exported audio file. If you have any questions on GarageBand or any other music production software, hit us up on Twitter at WinkSound. Join the conversation by following WinkSound on Facebook, Twitter, and YouTube to keep up with everything you need to know about music and audio technology.